دير فيرست بريب السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته It's Mr. Ahmed Mahmoud with you today to introduce a new lesson The lesson today in sha Allah it's algebra it's unit 2 lesson 9 The lesson about factorization by take out HCF In this lesson in sha Allah we are going to learn how to identify uh, HCF and how uh, what is the meaning of HCF and uh, we are going inshallah to uh, solve many problems about it and uh, solve problems about the uh, missing term let's start the lesson first we need to know the meaning of HCF HCF uh, is the abbreviation of the word highest common factor highest common factor okay from the word highest we take H and from the word common we take C and from the word factor we take F okay finally it will be HCF HCF or the highest common factor divided in two types the first type is the number the numbers are the highest common factors of the number that means if we have numbers like 6, 4 and 10 we ask ourselves what is the common table between the three numbers okay the common table here here 6 in table 2 and 3 4 in table 2 10 in table 2 and 5 then we find that the common table here is 2 another example if we have 6, 9 and 15 6 in table 3 and 2, 9 in table 3, 15 in table 3 and 15, we get that uh, 3 and 5, then we get that three, uh, 6, 9 and 15 are in table 3. Another example, 10, 20 and 15, 10 in table 2 and 5, 20 in table 2, 4 and 5, and 10, 15 in table uh, 3 and 5. We get that the common factor here is table 5. Okay, another one 12, 18, and 12, 8, and 16. Here, 8, 12 in table 2, table 3, table 4, table 6, 8 in table 2, and table 4, 16 in table 2, table 4, and table 8. Then we find that the common table here. We have two common tables, we common table in 2 and the common table in 4. Then we choose the highest of them, the highest common factor, which is table 4. Now we remember the meaning of highest common factor according to the numbers. The new object with us, the highest common factor for the symbols. For the symbols or the letters, we search about the common symbol in the expression and choose the smallest power in the expression for example if we have x power of 2 and x power of 3 and x power of 4 we have here x x here is common in the three terms then we find that the the, the common x or the highest common factor here is the smallest common power of them which is x to the power of 2 as we see the next one if we have three terms like this y x power of 3 y power of 2 and x power of 2 y power of 3 and x power of 4 okay then we are going to choose the smallest y and the smallest x because y is repeated in the three terms and the x is repeated in the three terms y here the smallest y here we have y power 1 y power 2 y power 3 the smallest one is y and we are going to choose the smallest x which is x power of 2 then finally the highest common factor is y x to the power of 2 and this is the meaning of hcf now let's solve example 1 the example here start with factorize factorize each of the following by identifying HCF or by take out HCF first I need to 
explained the word factorize. Factorize means change into two factors or more. For example, if we have a number like 6, if I need to factorize 6, I will change 6 into 2 times 3. Now I make factorization for x. Then the factorization means change the number or the expression into product. Another example. If I need to factorize 3y, then it's equal 3 times y. Okay, I change 3y into 3 times y. But here I have an expression. The expression is 5y minus 10. Okay, to factorize this one, we have two steps. The first step, we are going to take out HCF or to identify HCF. Okay, by looking to the two numbers forming the expression, 5 and 10. 5 and 10 here in table what? I, th I think it's easy. Okay, we ask about our ourselves about the common table. It's table 5. Okay. And here we have y in the first term, and we haven't y in the second term there, then there isn't any other common factors except 5. This is step 1. Identify the common factor. Step 2. We are going to open bracket like this, and divide the expression by the common factor 5. Okay, then I'm going here to divide by 5. And here divide by 5 and write, write down the remainder or the quotient of the division inside the bracket and this is the factorization 5 divided by 5 equals 1 and write down y then negative 10 divided by 5 equals negative 2 then the quotient of the division is uh, 1y minus 2 but we explained many times that this one is useless then I'm going to cancel this one finally I have factorized 5y minus 10 into 5 times y minus 2 we can easily uh, check that we are right by simplify this bracket 5 times y equal 5y and 5 times 2 equals 10 it's easy to check that we are right. Okay, the next example. <coughs> we have here 3x power of 2 and 6. We have here 6, sorry, 3, and we have here 6. Okay, in that one, we are going to choose the common table. The common table here, huh, 3 and 6 both in table what yes it's in table 3 and we have also x power of 2 and x power 1 we are going to choose the common x but we are going to choose the smaller one which one is the smaller here yes it's x power 1 then finally the common factor is 3x second step open brackets then divide by 3x here and here 3 divided by 3 equal 1, x power of 2 minus x power 1 equals x power 1, 6 divided by 3 equals positive 2, x power 1 over x power 1 cancelled, but don't forget to cancel the 1 here, then the expression will be 3x uh, times x plus 2. The next one, we have here 35 and 10. Okay, 35 and 10, both in table what? <laughs> yes, it's in table 5. Again, 35 and 10, it's in table 5. But, if one of us, okay, doesn't, remem doesn't remember the, com the uh, timetable, then I'm going to learn you to teach you um, a new method to find the common factor like this. 
Okay, here we have 10 and 35. And draw a dash like this. Remember with me the prime numbers. The prime numbers, prime numbers are 2, 3, 5, and 7, and so on. Okay, the prime numbers. Choose a prime number common in the two tables here. 10 and 35 doesn't, don't divisible by 2, and they are not divisible by 3. They divisible by 5. Choose 5 here, and then divide. 10 divided by 5 equals 2. 35 divided by 5 equals 7. And here, 2 and 7, okay, are not divisible by 5. Divis are not divisible by 7. Then, this one is the common, the highest common factor, which is 5. Okay, back to our lesson. Here, 35a plus 10a, um, power of 2. Okay, we said that the common factor here is 5. Between 35 and 10 is 5. And a and a2, a power 1, a power of 2, we choose a power of 1 because it's the smaller power. And here we are going to divide it by 5a in each one. 35 divided by 5 equals 7. a over a, or a minus a, 0. 10 divided by 5 equals positive 2. a power of 2 minus a equals a. Then the expression will be 5a multiplied by 7 plus 2a. Okay, let's solve the next one. We have here 6 um, and 4. It's easy to choose the common factor here. Huh. 6 and 4 are in table. Mm, it's in table 2. Okay. A power of 3 and A power of 2, we choose the smaller, which is A power of 2. B power of 2 and nothing. There aren't any B here, okay? Then B is not a common factor. We, okay, then the common factor will be 2A power of 2. And then open the brackets and step, the next step divided by 2A power of 2 and 2a power of 2. 6 divided by 2 equals 3. a power 3 minus a power of 2 equals a power of 1. negative 4 divided by 2 equals negative 2. a power of 2 minus a power of 2 cancelled. b power of 2 dropped down. Then the final answer will be 2a power of 2 multiplied by 3a minus 2b power of 2. The next one, 49 and 7. 49, it's easy to check that 49 and 7 are in table. Hmm. Are in table. Yes, it's in table. There are table 7. And now, b power of 2 and b power of 3, we choose the smaller b, which is b power of 2. Then open the brackets divided by 7b power of 2 and 7b power of 2 okay uh, it's need not to write 7b power of 2 here you can write down the answer directly without writing the common factor in this place okay uh, 49 divided by 7 equals 7 b power of 2 minus b power of 2 0 cancelled 7 divided by 7, or uh, sorry, negative 7 divided by 7 equals negative 1. b power of 3 minus b power of 2 equals b. And finally, I'm going to cancel this one, and you know the reason. Okay, the next one, okay, I will not write the uh, common factor down here in the next one. We have here 8, 4, 
and 6 all of them are in table what <laughs> yes it's in table 2 and then a power of 3 a power of 2 a power of 1 the smaller a here is a power of 1 and then I'm going to write down the brackets and then we are going to divide all of them divided by 2a okay you can write 2a here here and here or you can write the division direct inside the brackets I will write the division direct inside the brackets okay 8a power of 3 divided by 2a it's equal 4 a to the power of 2 4 a power of 2 divided by 2 a it's equal positive and negative 2 a power of 1 6 a divided by 2 a 6 divided by 2 equal positive 3 and a minus a equal 0 we cancel it okay let's solve the next one We have here 2x power of 2y plus 6xy power of 2 minus 2y. Okay, in this one we have the common factor. I will solve it here, okay, because this space is not enough. Here I have 2, 6, and negative 2. Okay, it's easy to know that the common factor is what? Okay, think with me. 2, 6, and 2. They are in table? Yes, it's in table 2. x power of 2, x power 1, and none. There is no x in the common factor. Okay, let's search y. We have here y power 1, y power of 2, and y power 1. Then y is common. Then I will choose the smaller one, which is y. Then open the brackets. Okay and divide by 2y here here and here okay 2 divided by 2 equals 1 x dropped down power of 2 and y minus y 0 6 divided by 2 equals a positive 3 x dropped down y power of 2 minus y equals y negative 2 divided by 2 equals negative 1 and y minus y cancelled okay here I'm going to cancel I have one here and one here which one cancel and which one can't be cancelled yes this one will cancel because there is um, x power of 2 and this one I can't cancel this one because I haven't any symbol here okay the next one in this example we have here 32 16 and 8 I think it's difficult to find the common factor then I'm going to solve by using the way of common uh, of the prime numbers like this uh, we have Three numbers are 32, 16, and 8. And remember with me the common, sorry, the prime numbers are 2, 3, 5, and 7. Okay, first I'm going to choose. All of them can divisible by 2. Then I will write 2 here. 32 divided by 2 equals 16 16 divided by 2 8 8 divided by 2 4 again 16 8 and 4 yes all of them divisible by 2 then I'll choose 2 here 16 over 2 8 8 over 2 4 4 over 2 2 again 8 4 and 2 they are divisible by 2 8 divided by 2, 4, 4 divided by 2, 2, 2 divided by 2, 1, and now they are not divisible by 2, they are not divisible by 3, they are not divisible by 5 or 7, then the common factor formed from 2, 2, and 2.
2. Okay, the highest common factor here is formed from 2 times 2 times 2, then H C F here equal to 8. Back to our example. Here we have the common factor is 8. Then the expression will be I will write 8 here, here, and here. I will choose x power of 3, x power of 2, x power 1. It's x power 1, it's smaller. y power of 3, y power of 2, y power of 1. It's y power of 1. And then I'm going to write 8 x y open brackets and then divide a32 divided by 8 equals 4 x power of 3 minus 1 equal x power of 2 y power of 3 minus 1 equals y power of 2 16 divided by 8 equal positive 2 x power of 2 minus 1 equal x y power of 2 minus 1 equals y 8 over 8 equals positive 1 x over x cancelled y over y cancelled here I have 1 without symbols then I can't I can't ignore this one or I can't cancel then this one let's solve the next example factorize each of the following by identify or take out HCF okay we have here two expressions okay by looking to 3 and 7 is there any common factor between 3 and 7 no okay here x and here none there is no x in the common factor but you notice with me we have this bracket is common a plus b and a plus b is common then the common factor in that case is the bracket itself then we are going to do what first i'm going to write the common factor here which is a plus b and then open bracket like this and then i will cancel a plus b and a plus b from both to both expressions okay 3x here will write down and the positive 7 from here will write down inside the brackets then it will be open brackets a plus b times another bracket 3x plus 7 another example here we have x plus y 4 and x plus 4 are common and here we have x power of 2 we here we ha and here y there isn't x or y in the common factor then the common factor is the bracket only then here we are going to write equal and the common factor outside like this x plus 4 open brackets cross the bracket from here and from here the remainder from each one equal x power of 2 plus y to the power of 2 the next one we have here uh, 14a bracket x plus y minus 21b x plus y first we have here 14 and 21 there in both there in table what yes it's in table 7 and here we have a and here we have b there then there aren't a or b okay here we have x plus y here we have x plus y then the bracket is common okay then i'm going to first i will write 7 open brackets x plus y 
open brackets 14 divided by 7 equals 2 and write down a of course I will cancel the two brackets together negative 21 divided by 7 equals negative 3 I will write down B from here the next one okay in this one I have 12 and 8 12 and 8 are in table what okay 12 and 8 are in table back to our uh, prime numbers way 12 and 8 2 3 5 and 7 they are in table 2 12 divided by 2 equals 6 4 divided by 2 equals 4 divide by 2 3 and 2 okay by 2 again they are not divisible by 2 3 and 2 not divisible by 3 not divisible by 5 not divisible by 7 then the common factor here will be 2 by 2 then the common factor equals 4 okay okay then back to our example like this the common factor is 4 here and here now we have x power of 2 here and x here then we write down x here we haven't y and here we have y then there isn't y in the common factor but don't forget x plus 1 the bracket and the x plus 1 the bracket okay then we are going to write <coughs> 4x open brackets x plus 1 open brackets cancel x plus 1 from here and from here 12 divided by 4 equals 3 x power of 2 minus x equals x negative 8 divided by 4 equals negative 2 x minus x 0 and write down y let's solve the next one 24 a power of 2 uh, times a minus 2 minus 36 a power of 3 times 2 minus a first uh, back to prime numbers <coughs> like this um, here we have 36 and 24 and don't forget the primes 2 3 excuse me 2 3 5 and 7 36 and 24 in table 2 uh, 36 divided by 2 18 24 divided by 2, 12. 18 and 12 are in table 2. 18 divided by 2, 9. 12 divided by 2, 6. 6 and 9 are not in table 2. But they are in table 3. 9 divided by 3 equals 3. 6 divided by 3 equals 2. 3 and 2 are not in table 2. 3 and they are not in table 5 and they are not in table 7 then uh, the common factor included 2 2 and 3 I, I'm going to multiply them then the H C F equals 2 times 2 times 3 which is equals 12 back to our example okay here we have 
table 12 in both term and here we have a power of 2 and a power of 3 we, we will choose the smaller one okay and a minus 2 2 minus a okay there is a problem here they are not like but they have the same numbers the difference in the sign then we are going to consider the first one is a common factor and change the middle sign here like this it's equal 24 divided by 4 equals 2 excuse me first I start with writing 12 a power of 2 open brackets I will choose the first bracket a minus 2 and then open another bracket okay 12 the 24 divided by 12 equals 2 a power of 2 minus a power of 2 0 okay then I'm going to change this sign how why because I will change this bracket to be a minus 2 not 2 minus a then this one will be plus okay then I will change this one here minus from minus to plus and then complete the factorization 36 divided by 12 equals 3 a power of 3 minus a power of 2 equals a and this is the tricky one in this lesson don't forget to change the middle sign and complete the question okay as the previous one okay <clears throat> the next example find the result by identifying the HCF this one is exactly like the question which uh, we took before factorize as excuse me solve by using the property of distribution if you remember this one okay now we will do what we have here two expressions 48 times 45 and 48 times 55 we find here that 48 is common as you see okay then it's equal 48 and I'm going to cross it from the both terms times open brackets here the remainder is 45 and here plus and here the remainder is 55 and then you can use calculator directly but but I will continue uh, write down 48 times the result of the brackets is 100 then the final answer will be four thousand and eight hundreds but it's allowed to use calculator from this uh, from this step okay it's up to you uh, the next example the next one use the factorization to solve this one I have here three expressions 15 times 17 15 times 13 15 times 30 okay it's clear that the common the, the common here is 15 okay I will write down equal 15 times open brackets cross 15 from each one the remainder will 17 plus 13 minus 30 and then I can use calculator to give me zero the next one okay we have here 58 to the power of 2 58 to the power of 2 means 58 times 58 plus I will continue the next one 58 times 42 like this again 58 power of 2 means 58 times 58 
plus 58 times 42. Okay, it's clear that the common factor here is 58. I will choose one from here and one from here. And then it equals 58 times open brackets. Cross it from here and here and, and from here. The remainder will be 58 plus 40. Two, and then by using the calculator it will be 5,000 and 800 okay the next one and the final one example 4 complete the following okay we have here 6a power of 2 plus 12ab okay by dividing by here and here by 3a 6 divided by 3 equals 2. A power of 2 minus A equals A. 12 divided by 3 equals 4. A minus A cancelled. And write down B. The next. Here I need the common factor from here and here. 12 and 16 both in table 4. X power of 2 and X power 1. I will choose the smaller one X power 1 y power 1 and y power of 2 in table y okay and then I will divide by 4 x y in both term 12 divided by 4 equals 3 x power of 2 minus x x y minus y cancelled 16 divided by 4 equals 4 x minus x 0 y power of 2 minus y equals y next one here I will divide it by 7 7 divided by 7 1 x power of 2 write down positive 14 divided by 7 equals a positive 2 and write down y power of 2 don't forget to cancel the one because we have already x power of 2. Final one. We have here this expression. I just am going to identify the common factor. Here we have 4, 2 and 2. They are all in table 2. x power of 2x and x power of 2. It's in table x y power of 2 y power of 2 and y it's in table y and this is the end of the lesson i hope it was useful for you assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh mr ahmed mahmoud was with you see you in the next video inshallah